I'm very pro younger guys. I'm telling you, they're very sweet. They're very caring. They want us to have orgasms. This guy always wants to check to see if I have an orgasm. After we have sex, he's like, did you him? I'm like, of course not. When would that have happened? My hands are up here. What do you, what? Is that a bird call? What the is going on over there? No, he's very into that. And like, he's very into like toys. For Valentine's Day, he got me a toy. As my main gift, he showed up with this gorgeous box, gives it to me. He's like, I found this toy for you on Instagram. It's made for women by women. I opened it, it's gorgeous. It's like this glass orb. I was like, baby, this is stunning. We should put this on the coffee table. I would, I would buy this at West Elm. How much did you pay for that? He was like, it was $180. I was like, oh, you're gonna return that right now. And I will masturbate with the cash. So. Something you don't know about me is that my kink is thrift, and I'm never gonna be able to have an orgasm knowing that was $180. Get the f out of here. Okay, you're dating an older woman. We're ratchet as f when it comes to sex toys, okay? We came up on the jelly $18.92 veins. That's a bargain. No, that is a bargain. <laughs> they saved money because they molded those jelly to a homeless man who had just overdosed on methamphetamine and cocaine. They were like, we got it! <sighs> now all we gotta do is cover it in glitter and it's ready for market. <laughs> Those jelly had a suction cup on the back. You just pop that shit onto a wall. Or a washing machine in my case. That is a product made for women. <laughs> Is anyone dating an older woman? Younger man, older woman? Yes, one guy, okay. How much older, how much older is she than you? Three months. Three months. <laughs> That's your definition of older woman, got it. How old, how old, may I ask how old you are, sir? 53, oh, okay, okay, got it, got it. Oh, you do get points for that. Do you have a life insurance policy on her, or what's, uh... <sighs> her, he went, her job does. Uh... <laughs> I do feel like a lot of guys are now dating older women. It's kind of progressive, but at the same time, you gotta watch it. Don't just pat yourself on the back. You're not, you can't waste her time. You, know, you can't trifle with a woman in her 30s. You know what I'm saying? If you're dating a woman in her 30s, that's like going to the grocery store and buying avocados. You better have a plan. <laughs> you don't just go to the grocery store willy-nilly and decide, I'm gonna buy some avocados. No, you better have guacamole in your cart. You better have a party coming up because you know exactly how that's gonna end. Day one, you look at those brand new avocados, you're like, I got all the time in the world. <laughs> You have five days. Like my dude, I tell him, I'm like, I don't give a Like you're gonna marry me. Like I will propose to you. I don't give a okay? I'm not gonna just let you watch me rot while you plan a scavenger hunt. <laughs> so that I can hunt for my ring, following a treasure map into the woods like a truffle pig. Like, <laughs> can I have my ring please? You guys overthink the proposal thing. I also, I feel like I want to get ahead of it. I don't want him to get down on one knee and propose. Like, I don't want him to see my neck from this angle. Like, I feel like I'll lose a lot of leverage. Don't you dare shoot my neck from this angle either. No, I do not understand why women don't propose to men more. Um, I always thought that was weird until I actually thought through it. I was like, why don't I just get down on one knee and propose to him? And then I realized why, because I thought it through, right? I was like, okay, I'm gonna get down on one knee. Pop, pop, crack, crack. And I realize that if you're a woman proposing to a man, you have to open with something completely different than the guys have to open. I would have to open with, if you take your out right now, I will kill you. <laughs> I thought 
that maybe all of our friends and family behind me might be a dead giveaway that I'm not gonna <laughs> your <laughs> on this beach <laughs> next to your niece who's filming. <laughs> but I guess I have to say this. Also, what if I <laughs> your in one name? What have I ever been in this configuration, okay? I would, I would never <laughs> your in one knee because I know you would think about Colin Kaepernick and we can't both be doing that. <laughs> Then I would just go into my romantic speech. I'd be like, Alex, will you make me the happiest woman in the world and let me buy my own engagement ring because you can't afford the one I deserve. 